Foreign Minister Takayaki Matsumoto attended the G8 Foreign Ministers meeting held in Paris on the 14th and 15th of March 2011. The Great East Earthquake had occurred just a few days before the G8 meeting. As Minister Matsumoto worked to battle the consequences of the disaster, he decided to attend the meeting while cutting his trip as short as possible, in view of the keen interest by the international community, including the G8 in the earthquake. This G8 foreign minister's meeting was held for two days. On the first day, French Minister of Foreign and European Affairs Alain Juppé hosted a working dinner. At the outset, Mr. Juppé expressed G8 sympathy to the people affected by the Great East Japan earthquake and their solidarity with Japan. Minister Matsumoto expressed his gratitude for the support from overseas and briefed the other ministers on the disaster. Later, discussions centered on the Middle East and the North Africa region, particularly the situation in Libya. On the second day, the ministers discussed the following topics among others. The situation in the Middle East and North Africa, North Korea, nuclear disarmament and non-proliferation, Africa, Afghanistan. At the joint press conference after the meeting, Minister Matsumoto said, On the sidelines of the G8 meeting, Minister Matsumoto held bilateral talks with foreign ministers of Russia, the United Kingdom, the United States, the EU, and France, respectively. On the first day, Minister Matsumoto had a meeting with Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov. During this meeting, Minister Matsumoto conveyed his gratitude for Russia's offer of support and expression of solidarity with Japan in response to the earthquake, stating that such support encourages the Japanese people. Regarding Japan-Russia relations, Minister Matsumoto expressed his intention to succeed the policy set forth by former Minister Maihara. Both ministers agreed to communicate frequently and continue dialogue between them. In his meeting with British Foreign Secretary William Hague, Minister Matsumoto expressed his gratitude for the sympathy and offer of support from the United Kingdom concerning the earthquake. Minister Matsumoto also expressed his wish to visit the United Kingdom at an early date, mentioning that Japan-UK relations have historically been very important. In the meeting between Minister Matsumoto and the U.S. Secretary of State Hillary Clinton, they discussed the Great East Japan earthquake, Japan-U.S. relations, and the situation in the Asia-Pacific region. Minister Matsumoto expressed gratitude on behalf of the government and people of Japan to the government and people of the United States for the various kinds of support from the United States in response to the earthquake. He also said that he would make every effort to confirm the safety of American nationals in Japan in cooperation with the U.S. Embassy in Tokyo. Secretary Clinton responded by stating that it is an honor to support Japan when in the face of such a difficulty, and that the United States is willing to provide Japan with any and every support needed. 
In his meeting with EU High Representative for Foreign Affairs and Security Policy, Catherine Ashton, Minister Matsumoto expressed gratitude for EU's warm support following the Great East Japan earthquake. He also stated that he would like to further strengthen Japan-EU relations. High Representative Ashton expressed her intention to do everything possible to support Japan in overcoming the aftermath of the earthquake. In addition, she stressed that she highly values relations with Japan from an economic standpoint and looks forward to the progress of the cooperative relationship between Japan and the EU. In his meeting with French Minister of Foreign and European Affairs Alain Juppé, Minister Matsumoto expressed gratitude for the consideration shown by the presidency of the G8 Foreign Minister's meeting, as well as for the encouragement and support given to Japan from France in response to the earthquake. Regarding reform of the UN Security Council, Minister Juppé reiterated that France is in support of Japan's permanent membership in the Council. As shown in this video, Minister Matsumoto participated in the G8 Foreign Minister's meeting and had five bilateral meetings with his counterparts before heading back to Japan.